All right, so let's get started. I'm gonna prep my skin first with skincare. My skin is super dry. I'm getting even like some acne because I was in Arizona. It was so dry there. When your skin is too dry, you know, you, you can also get acne like when your skin is too oily. So because of that, I'm just gonna leave my skin hydrating a little bit and then we'll do the whole skin together. So to tone my skin and re-energize and give me a glow, I always start with beauty water. This is, and this is my Ella Luz one, my all day beauty water. Then I come in with my oil, my beauty oil, which is, Perfect before foundation. I've reviewed this to you guys before. This is also a loose clean formula filled with super oils. It's very creamy, so it works perfect before makeup and it's very lightweight as well. So when I say it's clean, it's free from all the toxins and bad stuff that our skin does not want. Um, so I'm gonna leave that soaking in and I'm gonna put an eye mask on, an eye patch. This is from KNC Beauty. And I love how cute this eye mask is. A little star here at the end. And what I'm gonna do before I start eyes is just my lip stain. To give my lips a little bit of color already. This is from Our Luz as well. Um, and to hydrate my lips, I'm gonna use 24 karat lip therapy. Why I do my eyes, I'm all hydrated, okay? This is what I used. So I'm gonna start the eyes with Laura Mercier eye primer. All over my eyelid. What have you guys been doing the most lately? Like I started to go to the beach and I'm hanging out with a very small circle of friends, but um, you know, it's like limited. We're still not going out to party at night and stuff. So what are you guys doing? Like what type of makeup do you want me to do as well? Um, I know I've been doing a lot of natural makeup lately because I know that a lot of people are staying home and I really going out, but what do you want to see um, here on my channel? So let me know in the comments, okay? So now I'm gonna take my beautiful Ella Loose palette. You guys, I'm so excited that I developed this product. It is so beautiful, it's so me. It is called the Brazilian Goddess Palette. We just launched it and it has all the neutral colors that I'm addicted to. It has all the neutral colors that I love using on my everyday and also nighttime. It's a combination of matte finish and shimmery colors. I'm gonna show you a quick swatch of all of them here. Um, so we have a matte finish light nude color to highlight. We have a light brown color, which is my go-to. We have a little darker brown that can also be a base if you have darker skin tone. We have a beautiful gold shadow. And then we have a little coral matte finish color. It's like a peachy. I love doing this by itself, like on my lids, it looks amazing. Then next we have a shimmery brown shadow. It's like a brown terracotta, but with a lot of shimmer in it. It's gorgeous also to wear by itself. And we have a true terracotta, which is a very warm, deep brown. I'm obsessed with this as well. And last but not least, a super dark brown. It's almost black, okay? So those are the eight shadows and I'm gonna do first, like I said, a more day version and then I'm gonna transform that into nighttime or something more dramatic that you can still wear during the day if you want. Um, so let's get to it. I'm going to start with this lighter nude shadow under my brows. 
And this is a palette, you guys, that will go, will be perfect for every skin tone as well. And then I'm gonna take the warm brown with a fluffy brush and start on the outer corner of my eye to give depth. And it's very important to put that nude shadow on top because once you're blending this in, it's gonna give that real nice blended effect here once you put both together, right? If you have a darker skin tone than I am, you can be doing the same thing. It's gonna look very subtle with this brown here. This brown for me, I use it when I want more definition because it's darker on my skin. It's a bit more cold, this brown, than this one. But um, yeah, if you have much darker skin tone than me, you can also replace this with this one, okay? And then I'm taking a pencil brush and, and blending it down here my eye too, okay? Next, I'm gonna take this peachy color, which is so beautiful. I'm obsessed with it. And I love this for like, my everyday, just by itself too, is so beautiful. I'm gonna place that in there on my lid. So it's almost like I wanna show on this side, um, you know, you guys know when I use just like a peachy shadow on my inner eye and nothing else. Look how beautiful that is. And I'm mixing now the peachy with the nudish one to make it lighter. I love this, it's still very fall. So I'm gonna create everything I did on the other side, just recreate it. So I just did the same thing on both eyes. It's time for me to remove my eye mask. And before I do anything else, I'm gonna do the skin so then you see how much the eyes will enhance and pop up, okay, pop out, okay? So I'm gonna mix today two foundations, my Estee Lauder Double Wear, just a little bit of it, has more coverage because I have some acne today, it's bothering me. Um, and my, one of my favorites, which is Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. And I'm gonna mix that in with the tip of my brush. And with my damp sponge, just applying some more. do the skin really quickly. Now I'm gonna use concealer. Today I'm gonna use Marc Jacobs one, which is like a stick, but I love it. And with the sponge, just get in there. And now I'm gonna go back to eyes before we finish the skin, but you can see that it's already popping out so much. I'm gonna take the cooler brown, okay, with a more dense brush and apply it down here. Just to give more definition. And here I'm already trying to transform it to like Be more defined eye, not so everyday, okay? But since it's very neutral, it's very wearable for literally like any occasion that you're dressing up for. And I'm gonna take this beautiful um, shimmery shadow, which is gorgeous. And I'm gonna apply it right here under my eye, on the inner corner. I'm gonna pay, take, and now I'm elaborating it to more nighttime, okay? I'm gonna take one size black eye pencil.
and apply on my waterline. And with a flat definer brush, I'm gonna take the darkest shadow from the palette and I'm gonna follow this really close to my lash root. Ooh, and we're bringing drama to this eye. So the flat definer brush, a trick I, I even showed you, I've showed you guys this before, but define it here and follow the line and pull it out so you have like this beautiful lifted effect. And I'm gonna follow that on top as well and create like kind of smudged liner here. Look at that. This darker color is amazing to do like And if your liner is like crooked or whatever, take the tip of the sponge and just correct it with concealer. Okay. Okay, so now the last step, what I'm going to do for this dramatic eye is I'm gonna use gold, but I'm gonna wet the brush. I'm using my beauty water to wet the brush. You can use water too. I'm gonna take the gold shadow and I'm gonna take this beautiful gold shadow here. So you can use it wet or dry, okay? I'm gonna use it wet just for a little bit more drama. I'm gonna apply it on the inner corner of this eye. So now mascara, I'm using Pat McGrath one, which is really black. So let's finish off this skin. I'm gonna do a little bit of contour and I'm gonna use the Huda um, Tentor in light. And I like to contour with the sponge. So just dabbing it here on the right cheekbones. Forehead. A tiny bit. And now I'm gonna do a lip liner. I already wanna make my lips nude. Here I'm using Patrick Ta's She's Bold. And she's a beautiful brown. Let's finish the skin. I keep going back and forth. Sorry, guys. I'm all over the place today. So, um, Laura Mercier translucent powder and all over my eye area here. Just secure that concealer on. 
so I don't have to worry about touching up. Since my skin is very dry today, I'm not gonna apply a lot of powder, okay? Then take your favorite bronzer. This one from Givenchy is like almost over. It's like my favorite bronzer. Um, I'm gonna blend it here on top of that contour. Okay, now, now Dior highlighter. I also broke this one. <laughs> I break everything and they fall. They just fall over. And then a little bit of blush. This is also broken. <laughs> a little bit of blush here. Tiny bit of highlighter. I'm using Laura Mercier highlighter. And the blood the blush was NARS in panic, okay? the peachy, the orange side, the other one was pink. The one that broke. And now, very nude lipstick, okay? I got these from, um, I got these from Victoria Beckham and I love them. I'm gonna choose a color. I haven't worn them yet, but I just swatched it on my finger and I loved it. I think this is the color I wanna use, but there's two beautiful nudes in here. Okay, so the color I chose is Spice. Looks like this, the packaging. It's Victoria Beckham, okay. Ah, oh, such a gorgeous nude. I'm obsessed. You see the difference when you put the right lip with the eye? Like it changes everything. So it really changes everything. So now I'm just gonna finish off my full look with my All Day Beauty Water from Ella Luce. I can't live without this. It's always in my bag. I do it before makeup as you guys saw because it tones the skin and refines the pores and now after just to set everything in and it's gonna your skin is just gonna feel amazing and look beautiful um in like five to ten minutes after you apply it last but not least a little texture on my hair i'm using the ella loose dry texture spray that adds texture and volume I'm obsessed with this I'm getting so much good feedback on this product. I'm so happy because it really does work and the smell is insane. Look at that. Now I have volume, honey. And texture. And it also helps holding my curls, which is great. So here I am. Ready to go, ready for my dinner tonight. Oh, I love this dry shit. I love this texture spray so much. I'm gonna keep applying it. <laughs> All right, so this is my final look using the new Alaloos eyeshadow palette the brazilian goddess palette again it's a very neutral palette you can create 
very subtle eyes like you can use this on your everyday and create a really bold eye like i did today the colors are really for everyone every skin tone it's gonna look amazing on you guys i cannot wait to see you creating eye looks with it if you do please tag me it is available now on alaluz.com and i cannot wait to see you guys create eye looks with this please if you do create any looks with it tag me on instagram I would love to repost you. And yeah, I hope you liked the tutorial. I hope you liked the tutorial. Leave me comments down below with more video tutorial suggestions. I would love to hear from you guys. And yeah, I will see you soon. Thank you for watching. Un beijo. Ciao.